Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Aisha from Bags of Style. Um, today's video is actually a request of video from one of my amazing subscribers at, at SML80. Um, she wanted me to do a detailed review of this bag because she just picked it up. So I was like, why not? Definitely get this video up for you. If you're new here, please do not forget to subscribe. What are you waiting on? Join the family, we have so much fun here. And if you're returning, thank you for the continuous support. So anyway, guys, um, the way that I want to actually break down this review is first, give you the detail of the bag. Second, do what fits in the bag. And finally, what are my final recommendations of this bag, okay? So without any further ado, let's get into the detail of this bag. Alrighty, guys. So as I stated, this is the Coach 30. That's the size. This is a 30. They do have a Coach, um, the Coach Vogue 17, 25. 30 and I think they have a bigger size. I'm not sure exactly what size that I think it's like either 35 or 40. I'm not sure, but this is the 30. Okay. So this bag actually, the color is this is um authentic coach 1941 Vogue bag. It is in color black, so they consider this color um pewit slash um wash ombre. So that's the color right there, pewit slash wash ombre. Okay, and on the side of it, it has suede right here. As you guys can see, you see the suede on both ends. We got the suede right here. And let's get this. And then also on the inside, as you see right here, okay? Um, the bag, let's get the, the measurement of the bag, okay? So this bag measured at length. So from here to here is at 12 and, and one fourth and then the um the height from here to here is nine and three fourth and then the width from here to here if you guys can see my hand from here to here is considered six inches okay so that's the measurement of the bag and then when it comes to the strap, so it does have multiple strap, as you guys can see right here. So you have this strap right here, you have this handle right here, and then you have a longer strap. Let me see if I can pull it out or if it's right in the middle. Okay, let's get this. Okay, guys, so you do have the longer strap right here. This is the longer strap right there. Already, as you guys can see, so this is the longer strap, okay? So this strap, um, it has um, a drop of 21 and a half for shoulder and crossbody wear. That's it right here. And then you have this one right here, this strap right here, this two strap. This right here is 10 inches drop from the shoulder wear, okay? So that's what it is. And then the handle, this is the handle right here, guys. So this handle um, is three and three and a half drops. So if you guys want to see it right there, okay? So that's the measurement of the handle. So you got three different way of wearing this bag, okay? So let's get this off right here. As you guys can see, I haven't wear, wear it yet. I'm excited to put it on. So we're gonna put this on the side right here because it's still got the all of the tape in right there. Alrighty, guys. And so also, it does come with one credit card slot. Let's take this out. As you guys know, or if you don't know, I always keep the stuffing in my bag. I just feel like it keeps the shape of the bag, okay? So I haven't taken anything off. Let's take all of this off. So we're actually re-unboxing it again. <laughs> All right, guys. So the handles are falling off. <laughs> so as you guys can see on the inside, it has this packet right here. I also have the QR code from Coach right here. That says, wear it, love it, pass it on. Got information on the back. So it has two side, two side opening, as you guys can see. See right here, you have this side opening that has a pocket in here. This is the pocket right here for the first side opening. And then you also have a little, kind of like a little small. This is really tiny. 
but you can put like a little credit card or something. So you do. So this is the credit card slot, I think right here. That's the one credit card slot right here. And then on the other opening, you got a big opening in a big space. Then you got this, which is lined with canvas. If you guys can see, so this is lined with canvas. It has the coach story tag right here. It has another opening that you can button. And then on this side, it's another opening with the one credit card slot, like I stated earlier, okay? Um, on here, like I said, it does have an inside snap and multi-function pocket. These are all of the pockets right here, okay? Uh, one thing, well, also, just the FYI, if you do want to shop this bag, let me see if I can give you the tag for the style number. Okay, guys. So, see right here? So this is the tag right here. This is the style is C8012, right there. Style number again is C8012. And like I stated, this is in the Puit slash wash ombre multi, cause this is in color block. So this is the information right here if you wanna shop it. Um, I'm not sure if it's still available on the coach website. Um, if it is, I'll put it when I upload the video. If it's not, I'm sorry, but just keep watching, keep looking the coach website because it might come back up, okay? Um, just another FYI, so there's no pocket on the outside. So no pocket here and no pocket here, okay? And then on the bottom, it does have four feet. So right there, one, two, three, four, which is really good. And then on the sides, let me take this off. So as you guys can see, it zip all the way down, okay? So you got that. This doesn't move, but you can zip it all the way down if you wanted to, both ends as well. Zip it all the way. And then you got this little connecting piece right here, which kind of open like an accordion kind of situation on the side right here, okay? So that's how, this is basically the detail of the bag. Right there, I do, one thing I can really tell you guys, I do really, really, really love this color this look like a honey a honey um yellow but i do love it it just bring more light to the bag okay oh and another thing is this bag is actually made with natural pebble leather glove tan leather and the suede as i told you guys okay so it's a it's a combination so pebble leather right here as you guys can see i love that these are the glove tan right here you got the glove tan I think on the handles as well. One thing about it, if you guys can see, so you got the dark, the blue right here, but then look at this. This is like a light blue slash gray. It looks like it's a grayish color on the handles if you turn, look at this. So it's not the same blue on the inside. So that's one thing I noticed as well, okay guys? Alrighty, and then even here, see? On the opposite end, it's a different color. I mean, I think it looks good. Another thing also, with the buckle, you can adjust it. I love when you can adjust the buckle, honestly speaking. So you have one, two, three, four, five. So it's a five little holes that you can use to adjust the large one, the 21 drop handle, okay? So you got that. And then, I think that's really it. Um, another thing also I think is that because these new ones, you can kind of flap the, the handle like, if you don't want to use it, you can kind of put the handles inside, as you see. So you can just use it with these two right here if you don't want to show the handles. Or you can actually detach this. I love when a bag gives you that option. So you see, you can detach all of this. You can detach the long one and the two short one. The only thing you cannot detach are these handles right here, okay? That's the only thing. But all of the other handles, you can detach it. So if you want to put like a black chain or something on this bag to kind of match the little black accents right here you can do that because i think i might probably do that kind of to make it a little bit different than what everybody else have okay but so you can detach this detach this and also detach the long one this you cannot detach but you can put it inside of the bag if you want to hide it see right here so it literally just hide in the bag which is really really good um another thing also i know a lot of coach lovers on the bottom it doesn't say the glove tan leather. I know the the other um, Vogue bag did have that, but this doesn't have that. I think the newer Vogues, they're not putting those on there anymore. I'm not sure, because even on my 20, my Vogue 25, it was the same thing. So 
I think it's a new direction that coach is actually going. Anyway, guys, let's now do what fit in this bag, okay? Because it is a huge bag. It does have a lot of space. So let's see what fit, and then we can move on to my final recommendation. So I'm, so this is my brand new 13-inch MacBook Air. So let's see if this fits. Mm, uh, it really doesn't fit. So if you can put it this way, if you want to hold it that way, but because of these side things right here, it doesn't really go all the way for it to actually lay. See right there, guys? So it cannot lay on the side. So this really does not fit. I wish it did, but that's that's surprising. So let's get to the next stuff. Okay, so these are some daily essential. Let's see if all of those fit, okay? Alrighty, guys. So this is my phone. <laughs> well, my phone case. Um, this is the 12 Pro Max, which is what I'm filming on right now. So this is the case. So if anything, I can probably put that in here. Perfect. And this, I just grabbed this. This I use, this is like my planning supply stuff. If I want to plan and stuff like that, I got some little African <laughs> Sierra Leone. Uh, oh, this is uh, UAE money. But these are like my planning stuff and things like that. So if I want to take it with me, I can. Let me zip this back up. So let's see. This should definitely fit. All right. So let's put this on the outskirt right here. So that fit perfectly. Um, this is like a passport holder. If you want, if you're traveling, you can fit it on this outside pocket. Perfect. Right here. As you guys, if you guys have been to my channel, these are my husband's. So this is a five key holder from Coach. Um, that. And then this is like a little wallet. So those I can definitely put right here on, the, on this end, which fit perfectly. This right here is my mini planner right there. Keep everything. So this is my mini planner right here, guys. So if I want to fit that. So I can definitely fit that in. Let's see. So this is just a notebook. Just to do some notes and stuff like that. So, uh, well, because of the length of the notebook, it doesn't fit sideways, okay? So, but I think if I put it like this, it can fit. And I'm going to see if I can zip it up, okay? But let's just continue. This is just another opening and stuff like that if I want to put it in like another um carrying case you can put it over there this is my husband's stuff right here his glasses so we can probably put it in here so let's see so right now as you guys can see it is stuff so it is really stuff oh my god like just all of these stuff that I've put the bag is heavy <laughs> um it's really heavy okay um so let me see if i don't think this will zip up with the notebook so that wouldn't zip up because of how the notebook is because the notebook the length of the notebook doesn't allow it for it to sit flat so i have to stand it up so it wouldn't close but it's still fit though so this is what it will look like kind of have a little bulginess to it honestly but when you hold it by the handle it's really heavy very very heavy <laughs> um i'm not sure if you hold it by the strap how you will feel but honestly speaking i'm not taking all of this um when i go out or if i plan on using this bag but i just wanted to kind of give you guys what can fit so all of these stuff can fit in here if you actually want it but with the notebook you probably need a smaller notebook not this size because this size as i told you guys will not fit in the roll not even on the side pockets as you guys can see see right there it doesn't fit so you will need a smaller notebook if you wanted to take a notebook or anything around with you so definitely this will not fit okay and also like i showed you guys earlier a 13 inch laptop doesn't fit you might be able to fit an ipad or something like a 12 inch that might fit but the 13 inch 
um, MacBook, the MacBook Air doesn't fit, okay? So that's everything that fit right there. But it does fit a lot though, and, but it do get heavy. That's one thing I can tell is very, 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 very heavy. So just keep that in mind. If you're going to really stuff it, know that it is going to have weight to it. Okay, guys? So anyway, that's um, what fit. I've already given you the detail of it. My recommendation now. Would I recommend this bag? Definitely. Um, that's why I bought it. <laughs> I love this bag. I love the classiness of it. I think, honestly speaking, Coach going with the Rogue line, I think that's one of their best, 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 best in top design. So I do love this bag. I love that it gives you the the um, the um tote vibe. And it gives you like three different ways of wearing it. A lot of times when you get this type of bag, it's only one way you can wear it. So the fact that you can hold the top handle, if you want to hold the top handle, you can wear this little ones right here if you want to put it on your shoulder. Or you can wear it cross body with this long strap right here. That you can't beat that, and also, like I stated, this this one the retail price is seven ninety five, which is still a great price for this bag. Um, if you're thinking about buying it for that price, but hey, it feels even more amazing when I could get it for a sale. But my final thought is yes, if you want to get this bag, go ahead and pick up this bag because this bag is amazing. I love the fact that Coach put so much detail into the bag. It is simply beautiful i love the color i love the suede material it just feels so high quality and i do have very high quality very luxurious bags that coach honestly speaking beat them which is crazy because i spend so much more money on those bags than this bag and this bag beat them when it comes to just the make and quality of the bag so anyway guys this is the review. Um, if you guys have any questions or comments, please do not forget to leave it in the in the comment section below. Um, if you guys want me to do any other type of review for any other um, bags, please do not forget, leave it in the comment as well. I definitely respond to everybody. So anyway, guys, I will see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye.